Hello and welcome back. In this module, we'll learn how to install your Facebook Pixels to your landing page to track your site's activity. Why do you need Facebook Pixels? Well, the Pixels are a piece of tracking code that can be installed on your website's or landing page's analytics section. Facebook Pixels are used to track leads, track conversions, retargeting your audience and creating different lists, creating a look-alike audience, tweaking your landing page based on your audience's activity. All of this information is made available to you once you install the pixel code to your page. Now let me give you an example. Let's say you're in the internet marketing niche and you've recently launched your own product. The front end is a free ebook downloadable via your landing page. In order to download the ebook, the audience would need to fill in a form first with their details and then submit. Therefore, there are three steps involved in this process before they ever download the ebook. One, they visit your landing page. Two, they fill in the form. And three, they click Submit. When you install the Pixel, you're able to track all of these actions separately and which action did the audience perform. Did they only visit your landing page? Did they continue to fill in the form and click Submit? These are all important information pieces to gather, so in the end you're able to retarget your audience and identify specifically who they are. Most important, you can tweak your sales video, sales letter, or landing page content depending on your audience's activity and improve the performance of your landing page. This will inevitably attract more leads to your cause. How do you install the Facebook Pixel on your landing page? Well, let me talk you through the steps. First, you need to open your Facebook Ads Manager account. Then, on the top left, you click on the Ads Manager where you'll be directed to several options. You just need to go to Assets and then further down, you're able to spot the Pixels option. Click on Pixels. On the next page, you click on Setup, which is at the right-hand corner of the page. Then a pop-up will appear where it states Install Your Pixel Code. There will be two options which are Use an Integration or Tag Manager and Copy and Paste the Code. You will then click on Copy and Paste the Code. After that, you'll see Install Pixel Base Code, where there will be a code ready for you to use. All you need to do is click on the code and it will be automatically copied. Next is the code installation on your landing page. Now what you need to do now is to go to your landing page's Analytics slash Scripts section and paste the pixel base code on the header script section. Now you're all done. Make sure that you refresh your page as it may take 10 to 20 minutes for the pixel to be activated. To ensure that your pixels are installed successfully, head back to your Facebook Ads Manager and there will be a blue tick symbol indicating if you have installed it correctly. You can now track the type of audience visiting your landing page. The next step is to install your second pixel which is the Facebook Pixel Event Code. The event code allows you to track more specific events and conversions, where it is included nine different options from view content to complete registration. For this tutorial, we'll be focusing on tracking whether your audience submitted their details on your landing page, where we will utilize the complete registration Pixel Event Code. The steps are just the same as installing your first Pixel, but this time, when you've clicked on the copy and paste the code instead of opting for install pixel base code, you opt for install event code, where you can then lead to the nine different event options. Click on complete registration where you are in the given code. You copy the code and paste it on your download confirmation page where they will download their ebook if they choose to submit their details. The main reason why you need to install two different pixels on your landing page is so you're able to track the activity of your page in a more targeted and focused manner. In a nutshell, your first pixel tracks the activity and the type of audience on your site, and the second pixel specifically tracks if the audience submitted their details on your site. This will give you a higher chance in retargeting and creating your lookalike audience for your future launches. For more free educational content, visit learnforfree.biz. Content produced and distributed by AllSuperInfo.